All right, here it is. Surrounded with a pile of nachos. Looks fantastic. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to another food challenge video. Today I'm in Lapeer, Michigan, which is near Flint, Michigan. I am at Pueblo Viejo, about to attempt their El Grito burrito challenge. This is a giant burrito. There is a side of chips that is served around it. It is topped with queso, different sauces. The burrito is filled with, I believe, chicken, beef, vegetables, cheese, rice, everything imaginable. I've been really craving a good burrito and this one looks absolutely delicious. You have 45 minutes to complete it. If you do, you get a very cool t-shirt and you also go up on their wall of fame. Not sure what the record is. Without further ado, let's go inside, check this place out. All right, count of three. One, two, three, here we go. Cool Mexican flag. All right. Got some of these nachos. Wow. So there's jalapenos on this, which is definitely not my strong point. Thanks to the restaurant for taking the sour cream off the burrito for me. That's a nice burrito. It's steaming hot. Ground beef, shredded chicken. This is very good. Hey everybody and welcome back to another food challenge video where today I'm eating these nachos with a side of burrito. <laughs> Seriously, there were so many chips in this, it seemed like it would never end. Luckily this challenge tasted great. This burrito was filled with ground beef, chicken, rice, and tons of vegetables. Alright, a couple chips left. It was topped with red and green sauce and some queso. It was so good. With burrito challenges, a lot of times restaurants will use tons of rice as a filler, making it more difficult to eat and filling. This one did have rice in it, but not too much, which was great and added some good flavor. Ooh, we got a straggling chip. <clears throat> what are some of your favorite burrito fillings? One of my favorite burrito challenges had a pineapple salsa in it, so I'm going to go with that. Let me know what yours are down in the comments. Ooh, jalapenos are kicking. I have to thank the Michigan Thumb Facebook group for letting me know about this challenge. They actually have informed me of a lot of food challenges on the eastern side of the state. I don't know if I really went with any specific strategy for this one. I wanted to start by eating the inside of the burrito, but it was too hot when I started, so I just opted to eat the nachos that surrounded it. One thing I was really excited for for this challenge was the shirt you won for completing it. It's one of the funniest food challenge shirts I'd seen to date. Ooh, it's definitely a little spicy. Do you think I had what it took to finish this challenge and earn that shirt? Keep watching to find out. Thanks once again for tuning in to another food challenge video. Help the channel out if you can by clicking the like button and sharing the video with your friends. If you're not already subscribed, hit the button and the bell icon to be notified of all future uploads. Thanks for watching.
I think rice is great in burritos, in just my opinion. Thanks a lot. This is very good. Yeah, I'm glad you like it. I really it. like it. If you need anything, just let me know. Thank you. I will. <clears throat> Spices are good to me. keep my hands clean this time. Alright, get some of this tortilla now. My fork at another challenge. I haven't gotten a new one since. Alright. Got the tortilla now. Or tortillas, I think there's multiple tortillas. Now we just got these burrito insects left. I don't think we're going to be 10 minutes. there you saw it i finished the el grito burrito challenge at pueblo viejo in lapeer michigan i finished in 10 minutes and 44 seconds that was a very delicious burrito actually it was filled with shredded chicken ground beef cheese rice i love it when they have rice and burritos they're so good and then those nachos on the outside were actually very good there was jalapenos on there i guess i overlooked that uh yeah I, i'm a wimp when it comes to spice so uh, i was able to finish it anyway but um, they're not sure what the record is uh, or anything, but they said I had one of the better times. I got a very, very cool t-shirt for winning. Uh, I was the only one in the restaurant at the time I got here right when they opened. Uh, the staff was super nice. I uh, was really um, excited to see someone take the challenge. So if you're in the area of Lapeer, Michigan, make sure you swing by here. Very nice little place. Uh, food was delicious. Uh, and if you're feeling up for it, try the El Grito burrito. Tell them I sent you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you at the next video.